did you know? As you enter into St. Peter's Church, whether on the north side or the south side, we have doors that indicate, in a sense, the identity of who we are as St. Peter's Church. What we find is the upside down cross. And you see that on the bottom of the doors, the upside down cross depicts St. Peter. According to tradition, St. Peter was suffering persecution and martyrdom under the reign of uh, Nero. And during that time, he was to be crucified. And according to tradition in the church, he felt so unworthy to be crucified as Jesus was. And so he asked to be hung upside down. And so the symbol of the, of, of the upside down cross is the symbol of St. Peter. And so this is quite visible as you enter into our church. The other symbol that is present is what's called the key row. And what we find is that hero is, are the two letters of the Greek alphabet that really spell out the, the name Christ. And it's, they are symbols of Christ. The P and the X, those that's called Kiro in Greek. And what we find in, the, in this particular symbol is that Christ, again, is present in a hero, but it's also present in an upside down cross. What it says to us, I think, is that Jesus invites us to carry our cross. Whether we're right side up or upside down, it really doesn't matter. Um, he challenges us, no matter what, to pick up our cross and follow him. And so these doors are symbols of that very cross of Jesus, whether it was like Peter being upside down or like Christ right side up, it doesn't matter. What we find also, if you come into the narthex and the etch in the glass, is also an upside down cross. And again, it depicts St. Peter once more. And now you know.